Hey everyone. Wow. Please let them find this thing on the screen. Unfortunately, it is classified as a human being. So I hope they find this Eva Dustina, this thing on the screen. Let me just say this about the mental illness. We know it exists, but I'm really getting tired of it. It's like an excuse. Oh, mental illness. So let's understand this. She, obviously from what they're saying, it appears that she started a conversation, started an argument. No one approached her. She started the argument and had that bottle. So you mean to tell me that it's not like she just picked it up and got into a fight and, and, and found it. No, I'm willing to guess so much for the mental illness. And I have no sympathy here. If you have a mental problem, get your, get your behind some help. If you don't want any help, guess what? And you do something diabolical or that is dangerous to someone else, you need to suffer the same consequence as any criminal. I don't want to hear about your mental illness. So she's so mentally ill that A, let me guess, more than likely she's the one who put the substance in the bottle. You, you think? Left home with it. Went out into society with it to the subway. Picked an argument with someone and then pissed it on her. That To me, that sounds like planning. I don't want to hear about your mental illness. Because it looks like whenever someone does something, they have an old mental illness and they want to slap on the wrist. So maybe she's, she is mentally ill. She's also a danger to society. So this right here, they should find that solution and pour it all over her body. Let, drop, maybe they should drop some acid in it. Oops, I'm sorry. That's a bad idea. Maybe it's mental illness. No, it's just evil. Let's sometime call it what it is. So she knew to get that bottle, the substance that she created and poured into the bottle, go and buy it, go try to pick an argument with someone, a 21-year-old girl, and then put it on her. And this is the result. 21 years old has to go through life like this. Let alone the psychological factor, the girl looking in the mirror. Ah, because of who? Because of this trash right here. I, man, they need to convict her, put me on a jury. I have no problems. Life. And that's probably why the last time I went, they don't pick me because of I think next time it's going to be quiet. All because of this trash on the screen. Because of her. I bet this is nothing but a mammy failed evil black woman. And you're jealous. And let me tell you something. To you young women, not all of us because I'm older, but some of these chicks, you'd be surprised. The jealousy reigns a lot in all people. People get jealous of folks that have money. People get jealous of somebody who looks better. And guess what? A lot of women get jealous of you. Men do too. He may have ED and he mad at the youngster that, that don't have that problem. But a woman to get jealous of you? Oh, trust me. Where a person looks, you may not look like you just sad, sad and depressed. A person that is like that, they'll get jealous of you. So this here, when I saw I was a black woman, and I saw I saw this clip first. This is this is what another black woman has done to another black woman. I saw this clip first. And when I saw this first, I said, let me click on the other news report. And before I even saw it, I kid you not, not that it matters. But before I even saw the other clip showing who the perpetrator was or the suspect was, the alleged suspect was, or alleged perp, I said to myself, I bet it's another black woman. I said to myself, I will bet you a black woman did this to another black woman. And guess what? And boom, here it is. Chocolate drop. Chocolate drop. Did that pick? Listen, you see people, sometimes it's just best just to just ignore them. Don't even engage. They're not even worth it. They are so beneath you. A person can call you ugly, fat, skinny, anorexic, look like a Martian. Ignore them. That person's life is already blanked up, and who cares? I don't care. The older I get now, 
I see a lot of things a lot more clearer. Oh, look at this lady. She got how many kids? Oh. What where's her man at? Cause it looks like just a one year old. So how the heck are you you got a one year old? You you obviously breeding and having relations with a man because I've never known, maybe it's just me and I might be a little slow. Two women to get a get get together and get pregnant. There's a man somewhere. Wait, what you think? What you think? And they got this problem. Where's the man at? Because I see some children. Where's the man? Oh, I see. You want other women to, to go ahead and correct your problem with somebody else. Good luck with that. Me, I'm not engaging. What are they going to do? Hell if I know. Oh, that sounds cool. Well, guess what? I'm not, I'm not engaging because I see nonsense. I see ignorance. Go figure it out. Someone said to me, well, yeah, that's what black women do. Well, I said, well, I tell you what, I'm not a black woman today because I'm not picking up nobody else's burdens. No, no, I'm not picking up nobody else's burdens. I'm sorry. Call whatever you want to. That's what we're trained to do. So you have a lot of angry people, bitter people. Sometimes, I'm telling you, it's best just not to even... Don't engage. Someone you know, someone you don't know. This is where we are. This woman here has a whole lot of problems. I hope that still, I have no sympathy for her. I hope they lock her up. I feel for the victim. I would have no problem locking her up for the next 99 years. Well, you say she's got a mental problem. Exactly. And you are, an, you are a danger to others. So to, to make sure that we protect them, we're going to lock you behind up. This is a, in my opinion, it's a, and I don't care if someone doesn't like it. You got your opinion. I got mine. It's a, is this is a evil piece of crap on this screen. If she would have stopped breathing today, I wouldn't have a problem. And then this thing might breathe. Lord have mercy. She might spread whole uh, uh, IOD. This thing might breathe on the screen. More trouble. But I knew it. When I saw this, I saw this video first. And I before I even saw who the suspect was, I said, I bet it's another black woman that did this to a black woman. And lo and behold, look at this. 21 years old. Lord, I can't imagine. Life changed just like that. The evil among us. I'm telling you, this group does more evil. I'm not saying to do it to anybody else, but I'll tell you one darn thing. This group does more evil to its own than anybody. The clan can relax while they got chocolate drops on the block. They ain't got to worry. This group does more harm to itself than anybody. You got them working with the pen and the pad, and then you got these fools out here in the streets killing each other, throwing ass on each other. The women fighting the women, the women fighting the men, the men killing the women, the men killing the children. I bet the ancestors saw would look down and say, all of this sacrifice and fighting for what? When they look and see the savagery among us. The savagery among us. So just imagine this young lady, I the men, the physical toll, the mental toll. Been in the hospital for a few days. She may need counseling. Where's the time and money and the resources for that? And she wants to be a doctor. And yet, you're supposed to sit up here, I guess, after you become a doctor. Oh, let me get it. You're supposed to sit up here and they come in. Oh, I done got stabbed by my man. No, oh, no, this happened to me. You're supposed to sit up here and go ahead and just be willing to help them. Oh, my gosh. Why do you think? And I, I totally get it. Why do you think people want to be around people that are like them? People that have resources. I totally get it. They don't want no old um especially mentally some old broke down person has always got a whole bunch of problems a person that always brings a whole lot of they want one around them I, I i understand it i understand it there are a lot of angry people out there 
so she did this to another black woman to another woman don't even know i hope that man i would i cannot be a cop maybe just give me five just go ahead and just give me five minutes i would i don't want to, to find her Woo, girl we, we might not get to the station the evil among us so again a lot of people are very angry sick I'm starting to think if she when she left her old dingy wherever she lived lives I wonder if she planned this to put I'm gonna go ahead out to do this today and I'm gonna I'm gonna do this today uh, this sound like it's planned who walks around with that kind of substance who does that pick an argument does at a young girl's age maybe her beauty she may seem happy and you're nothing but a failed mammy with barely two biscuits to your old dingy name that's why i've learned the hard way yeah i used to be one of those oh he'll be in under no mm -mm. i see things now way clearer leave folks alone what they gonna do hell i don't know boo when you see people they want to pick it in. Again, sometimes people that are speaking to you, if it's negative energy, don't say anything. Don't even respond. I think this thing on the screen, she planned it. And I hope they find her. And I'm so sick of these Democrats with all these, uh, when it comes to these laws, the, the, the prison reform, the jail reform is, is not working out. They gave it a heck of a try. We see, we see it doesn't work. Too many sick people. Thinking, oh, well, it's too many. Give them a chance. Now we're seeing no. Some of them are in there because they belong there. So the Democrats don't always try to give you a little chance. It ain't working. People become worse and worse. Well, let them out. So it's to a point where some of them get incarcerated. It's on you. They've had people arrested. Let them out. Look up. Within hours, not even 24 hours, the same and commit another crime. So, so much for prison reform. But I knew when I saw the first report and I knew it was a black, I knew it, I knew it. I, I said, I bet another black woman did this. And lo and behold, this, uh, this over here, the chocolate drop, a black woman, pretty much worse for the Klan. I hope they find this trash and persecute. She deserves a life sentence. After all, the lady that was burned, her face looking like this here, she has to go through her life look, with this, with the injuries. Oh, they have makeup. It ain't about the makeup that can fix it. It's about what happened. Said before, said again, dust thin is just like the dust buckets. Who dust is being drama and dust thin is they being heartache, horror, and trauma. The financial implications is too much dust in the nation. Let me know your thoughts on this. Heartbreaking. Just like animal savages. I tell you, I, I think she planned this. I think when she put that solution in the bottle, whether she bought it or put it in there and picked an argument with that lady and put it on her, I think she planned it. She should be law. I don't care a mental problem or not. How about just evil? She may have a mental problem, but she's also evil. Let's not forget that part. She should be locked up for life. After all, she changed her life. So think about this. The ones I like to try to cave for people like that. Boo, what if this was you? So I'm done. Feel free to come, like, subscribe, and share. You guys stay alert, stay safe. You see dusty, diabolical, deadly behavior, dangerous, and trust your inner instinct with some people. I don't care what they say. Please, for your safety, I beg of you, ignore the nonsense. And whatever you do, please do not engage. Simply sat here on YouTube and I'm out.